Maybe it's, if it's just like a regular, just so if that last left, so, yeah. you know, so if I just hold that one there, and if you went to throw the other one, and then just went in. So it's, so it's quick aiming. Yeah, it's literally bang, 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 bang. We need a code name for this film. We got to get a code name. So since we equated our entire careers to the same sort of pulp abuse that the Coen brothers so uh, adequately described in Barton Fink, we said, all right, we're making a wrestling picture. That's what it is, a wrestling picture. So it's Burly Man. We are taking the hardcore martial arts performance of Wu Ping's fellows and we are going to embody that motion into the image of Neo and the image of Agent Smith to try to convert the real world into computer graphics. They'll both be diving at each other, right? If you want a CG dude come out, they're both, both diving. As he kicks off of that dude, he's, he's going to be a guy. Oh, just right. come, one guy running right at him, and he's just like, <laughs> maybe the other guy's like in the air. Interesting. What exactly is this for? You're actually here because Larry and you want to want to document it that we're doing work, right? You just, I just showed you like one of the most top secret scenes right there. Somebody contact the Canadian government. I'm here against my will. <laughs> Somebody contact the American government. <laughs> Get him out of here. You shut up. You shut up. <laughs> Doorways. It'd be cool if, like, you know, if it like opens up, if it's starting to reveal itself. If it had some of that electricity. Good idea. Concept artists start in doing things like this and give everyone a good idea of what the sets are going to be. So basically you get a book of these drawings and then from that point we go to sort of some similar working drawings and then a concept model to see if it actually works. Well I think the, the metal rail goes around the edge and then I was going to start it off like you had to kind of 
an entrance for construction for trucks, which would kind of block off. I'm just worried that like if something happens to this. Yeah, but you could do this like you know, this is a nice shot now. We got a camera car driving behind this. <laughs> they would do the barrel gag here. doing a whole bunch of zero-g shooting to get around some of the limitations of wire work and high-speed photography to go up in the zero-g. Suddenly a lot of limitations are removed and no longer attached to a wire so you can freely spin. It's like the best roller coaster ride you've ever been on. Okay, last call. Anybody else doesn't have goggles, doesn't have a respirator mask? Okay, that's just a taste of what's coming in this movie. Start out on a high. You want to start out with high expectations. You can't even. You got to reach for something. Where the ambition is on this movie. <laughs> Day two. Uh, can we lower the bar a little bit? <laughs> okay, shooting up there, stopping there, putting the collar inside here. This we can make as deep, you know, heavy or light as we want. So if you need, if the visual effects need we the highlights... just scratch it all off? Yeah, we can have it more silicone, but we can make it like there's hardly any, or you can make more. Oh, it kind of looks like we're pouring water up with one. Yeah. yeah. Might get a little black right. there. How about really hard? <laughs> <laughs> When we start a new project, this is kind of uh, praying for the safety for the whole project. It's a kind of uh, customary actions on most of the Hong Kong film. Pre-visualization is the process of taking storyboards and creating the 3D animation out of it. The sequences I've been working on uh, have Trinity riding the motorcycle as she's slaloming through traffic. Most of the cars, if not all, are going to be uh, CG cars. It's, it's a question of how fast the boom has to be and how fast the motion controller can actually go. If the motion controller can't boom up at the required speed, you can boom up at half the speed if the traffic drives at half the speed, and you won't notice just film up. It's going to come down to from 25 feet to 4 feet I don't think it's within 10 feet it's of these people. Guys running yeah. at the end at the very end. Okay. Did yeah. it come right around the camera? Yeah, one more time. Yeah. So that means you've got one, two, three, four, five swerves you're going to make. 
go around her. Cue ball. Whoa. Oh, and there's Richard. Cue ball. Richard's in the way. Go around there. Whoa. I mean, it's just like he's kind of halfway between the nib and the Zion. Yeah, I think like this part next to this is right. Mm -hmm. yeah, this feels good. Yeah, yeah. But maybe it just needs but to this open, open it up. Yeah. Maybe it just open it. Pull the bridge in a little tighter. Yeah. This one feels a little meaner. It's got a little bigger hole in it. Take one, see one. <laughs> what are you building? Uh, we got a little ramp inside of the garage, and Trinity right off the bat comes out of an underground or subterranean garage. So we're going to do a little pop jump ramp out in the street. We put uh, a little skid plate on the bottom with some uh, some products to give us some sparks. actually got left is a tiny little patch at the back so they can tie the wig to it so otherwise they shaved it all off.
this is about as big as it gets. <laughs> you know, as far as the amount of people and all the, the different departments that are involved with it and um, trying to keep up with everybody's a challenge in itself. It's that fine line. How the hell did they do that? Or there's no way they could have done that. That's the edge we dance on. We got that. So we got oh, cool. a breakaway there right. too. Excellent. And that whole, this whole thing we got. Think of cats, think of 200 cats, think of 200 cats driving their own cars. So that's what I do, I'm the cat herder. How you doing? I'm Philip Bello, um, and uh, partner over here is Walter Brown, and we're the team leaders for uh, the Precision Drivers. We kind of guide the regular background extra cars, and we try and add depth to the shot. You know, since they're not pros, you kind of want to keep them away from the cartwheel uh, cars and pieces of SUV that are flying around. Get to be outside. It's remarkably similar to, uh, you know, warfare. Long periods of incredible boredom punctuated by seconds of fear and panic. Although today is quicker than yesterday, we were out. We must have waited like, like three hours and we, we didn't do shit. Pictures up, stand by. The Matrix is literally the Matrix is crazy. And that's up. Here's the deal. When the answer car goes by you, give me a hard lane change all the way to the slow lane. I mean, don't turn it over. But you know what I'm saying? Just give me a nice wipe across, all the way across. That means he's coming at you. So pull forward. After the answer car goes by, just go whoa across the back. It just looks cool wiping across the back of her head. Okay? Danielle, it's going to be the insert car now because the little one is having a problem, so we're going to have to give him a little bit more room. Just so you know, it's the insert car now, the truck. It's the insert car now, so it's the, the truck. But it's the insert car now, meaning it's the truck. It's the insert car now. So it's a little longer, wider. Watch it. You got it. Thanks. Well, actually, they gave it six weeks to uh, paint it, get it all set. They want to rehearse it here. So we got four more weeks to finish all of this, which is a quite a lot of work. Paint it, age it, we're going to do all the work. All the work. Hey, Richard, I do all the work. <laughs> So when I back, when I punch him, yeah, when you, when you punch? so when I punch, right? Mm -hmm. And I take the step, then you're saying, just yeah, come go. back. Touch, you just touch. Here's the door. Right. So you gotta. No, you never go with full power. Yeah, we got uh, pads, baby powder. It's problem. I can Try. show you. Okay. Come on, full power. Power, <laughs> power. Okay. Punch him, give you cold. Okay. If, bye bye. He, if he didn't, doesn't go, uh -huh. he's four. His fault. His fault. Yeah. Never my fault. <laughs> Put it here. It's never my fault. They're called a pipe ramp. And um, the idea is to hit them so they come off the A arm on the back side of the tire. And what it'll do is it'll ride up that ramp. The kicker at the top end of the ramp will pop it and send the car over. Simple. As your camera is traveling across that center lane, you usually go up. And then hopefully by the time we get to the the other side of the lane, so it's, it's coming down far enough so that we're going to get underneath that truck. The four stop. They have three cameras on this car, on the the uh, high speed car. Two cameras on the wings. There's one in the, the center police car. And there's one on the back of uh, there's one on the back of Trinity's car. Five, six, three, six, seven. Seven cameras. Seven cameras. Okay, everyone in the vehicle, stand by. Effects are hot. This will be a take.
to look not through the middle of the eye but through the top right, of the eye. Right. And then look at him just and play something to him before I hit him with that. Just bring your eye up to this. What's going on? Keanu, you already up? Just that his gut punch. Bang, bang, elbow, back elbow, right there. Gut shot. Yes, yes, that's better. Not all together. Just two, three guys jump and the rest jump. This one, you use a sponge yeah, right. and the rest jump. Okay, two guys, Hugo and Mike. Okay, but together. Like jump high. No, no need yeah. to jump, you and Hugo. We punch just, together. Yeah, punch, yeah. Okay, okay. Like okay right. They hit, you guys are already in the air. Okay, try. Ready, so we just went bang. Bang. Boom. 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 Yeah. Okay, punch and jump up. <laughs> And then use the last part of the slab here for a pinch. Right, that's right. Troy. Troy. Right, yeah, we got that. And then we'll come out of here, and I'll give you maybe a, a slide, slide, maybe no, 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 maybe no, no. somebody so sliding out of the way of the truck and stuffing it into somebody over here in the fast lane. We'll just start with your left leg up there, and you're already in position, yeah. trap, spin. We really want a good landing, so I think you need to go higher. My feeling is that you're, they're not pulling you up enough, so I'm going to have them so we'll, we'll set our position and then we'll go. Action! Now! Cut! Okay. Oh, yeah. I just couldn't get out of your leg. Sorry. <laughs> All for you guys. All for you, brother Chelsea. And the kids. And kids. And for us. These films are for us. And when you're old. Playhouse, England. 
Check on. First, first day of the fight. Very excited. Yeah, very excited. For the cave sequence, it's going to be a gigantic cavern cave thing going on with uh, big crowds. He's forcing back. The next move is he's going to have his arms back and he kicks. Yeah. He gets up and he goes. It's 7 o'clock. We're still on the park fight set. We're going to do a pickup shot that we missed uh, linking part two to part three. Overtime. 18 hours. Ready. Three, two, one, go. So what's happening today? Uh, we're starting our fittings for Zion. We're doing uh, about 40 fittings. What do you think of the costumes that you're trying on? Uh, actually, I, li I like this. Can I take this home? Uh, all right. Stay on, you good? All right. Rehearsal and action. Cool. 
Hey, Keanu, uh, for the kicks, you're doing Hugo. But I think they should both be in the air, if you guys agree on that. Okay. If that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Come and Jesse. Right now we're just doing finishing touches. So I'm trying to marry the floor into the uh, slide tags. Bye. Matrix. All right. We're going to start with the diaphanous revelers. We're going to bring you in first. All the diaphanous revelers. And you're going in. Your shoes need to be taken off and taken to the left. We've got 950 extras on the temple set. 969 to be exact. We're just breaking people down, making sure they don't look too modern, too tidy. That's the general theme. We're going in for the party. Come join us. Man, you know what? Don't you? I got it. Welcome, folks. What we're going to do now is start grouping people up. You're coming into your groups here. And the two groups in the back, if you could spread out a little bit more. There's a lot of people. Where did they get all the people from? This is huge. Huge. Never been in, around anything anywhere near this big. Start walking towards his end. No, up. why don't you put him in, uh, like, and we'll get him to hold him up, okay. and then we'll do a Can't safety meeting this. from up here with all the people who have got uh, torches. The food is great. We wait. Women. We just waiting for our dance scene. The, 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 the women. The women. The women. It's a meat market. <laughs> <laughs> Temptation cavern here. This is so much fun. This is the largest and group of dancers in the world. Improv, improv, kit. Improv, 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 kit, improv. You need to be uh, a little bit more sensual. You need to be wrapping around her a little bit. Just um, give me a different look with your arms, okay? People that are lifting, people that are jumping, people that are up there. It's like it pops right out immediately that you're looking at the camera like, oh, look at me. And that, that take will not be in the movie. So if you want to be in the movie, don't look at the camera.
Charlie, great to sit down, mate. Maybe you could chase up RA again today and see what happens. Because Aaron from the Special Effects Ring was about the spearing into the wall and where that would be, so I rang RA to ask if he, they can get some sort of position. He was going to talk to Chad. So Sub Metro 2 should be finished by Friday. That's great. Get our first one out of the way. what it is. It's um, a painting from the cast of the crew of The Matrix that is going to raise money for a fire station where they lost 11 of their guys. And the actual painting will go up in the fire station. As all of you know, our world has changed. And we all have an opportunity to be a part of something that is incredible, that has affected the lives of people all around the world. So, the most important thing that we can do now is to give as much as we have of ourselves to this particular project. We must continue to move forward. We must continue to help each other, to lift each other up, to work together with strength, with love, with fear, with everything that you have. I ask that you bring it. of the importance of the right. oracle. Okay. And so you're bringing, and you're bringing That's what the spin oh, is. that's the spin, okay. And we'll see what he's saying is, no, you're asking us to disobey a direct order. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's true, it's true yeah. you have You got me. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. But it is true you have to disobey a direct order, but it's because it's important. Okay, right. First positions, please. Chemistry, chemistry, chemistry. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. I am asking that one ship remain here in our place just in case the Oracle should attempt to contact us. Bullshit. You're asking for one of us to disobey a direct order. That's right. I am, but we well know most of us are here because of our affinity for disobedience. It's the feds! Get to your exits. Cut. <clears throat> We're clear. Hi, how are And perhaps a closing two here. And then probably flop back over here to the wide to do the big uh, exit. Whoa! Yeah, that's good. So, are we going to do like a bit of like the end of the phase, like he's just phase, or will that be like a continuous kind of action? Yeah, we'll do the last bit of the phase where he's here. Yeah. And he's like just loaded up. Ghost man comes up. Marble there. That looks like the right colour compared yeah. to this is a 
got a bit of a yellow cast to it. <coughs> okay. I think we'll just leave it as it is, pretty much, and that we just cut this so that it overlaps here, so that to that line there. Yeah. for about a month in pre-production or pre-building so that we get all these pieces together. Talent come through, through downstairs, up these stairs with a confrontation here. These walls will come out. The ceiling is allowed to float out, which means by floating, they'll have to be jacked up on the chain blocks and wheeled down the length of the building. Come around to here, this far on this side. You can go back to here on this side. You can go up here. You can go down here. What are the, the, this is for the, for the rain. This is yeah. So you can and rain just goes here. Yeah. Big enough to get the camera in there. You got the cut. Yeah, I see these things. I can bring my arm up and then bring it down and it's going. Yeah. I can like this. What I like about the seal? It's like a seal going through the water. That's how I'll describe it when I'm impressed. <laughs> how was it flying? Well, it felt like a seal. A baby seal. A baby seal. <laughs> Being capture uh, on oh, Hugo here. Can we put the, where the marker would move the most on the face. And then we'll take that data and apply it to a 3D mesh of Hugo's head. And it'll move just like it. Whistle. Great. Big open smile. All right, a closed smile. Closed smile? Yeah, just, there you go. Um, can you yell, over there. Over there! Great. So we're gonna say hello, which means we should like have a beat of just static here, don't you think? To intercut with a static code vision shot. Then he comes in and he's like drawn in. Okay. And he comes to a stop and then he looks at him and then he sees the code. Yeah, and then why don't we play it that he, you're more drawn in by okay. what you see? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, so. Good. Fantastic. Let's shoot this one from the other side. Yeah, we'll shoot this one, we'll get the insert, and then we'll go over there. Cut! I'm trying, I have a wire coming out of the back of my head. Yeah, I know. So I can't, there's a wire on my head, so I can go sideways. Can we go back? What's up? Ready, and action. Good. Good. Pull that as you push your foot in. So pull up on it. Really hard to fly. Stuntmen only have large G-strings. Extra large or large. <laughs> I had a bit of a problem this morning. Oh, so I might have another cross too gone that away. Okay, so we've got that lady there. 
There can be another lady here. So why are they here? Um, sit on that table. Afternoon. Whatever time. Afternoon. How are you? We're good, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Look at this. Oh my god, yeah. this is fantastic. Very good. Isn't that great? These are your shoes, obviously. <laughs> That is fantastic. Where are we? One and two. King and Queen. Fishburne is the man. You the man. <laughs> the man. That is an actor. That is an actor unparalleled. You're the man. Hide. I have to hide behind anything. It's not a good look. It's just not a good look. And data. And action. One, two, shoot. Four. I'm gonna point your eye line just a little bit lower than it was when we were doing that really high, high look. Uh, so I'm gonna make it a little bit more three quarter out. Okay. And um, do the slow mo version first. Sorry, like, John, for yawning. Okay. Carrie Ann, completely riveted by the technological onslaught around her. Yeah, we think there's about 200,000, maybe maybe more. We lost count. I'd say 170. You reckon 170? Yeah, it took a while to find them too. We, Charlie spent three weeks ringing every uh, key locksmith in Sydney, basically. So the, these first six guys, Chad, should be down. Okay, guys, this is right, this is like the tail end of the video. And Hugo, you be at the back, so kill them. Just be careful of your reflections. What are you doing for? Hugo? Yeah. I wanted to double check <clears throat> your other Hugo's no, last no, position. No, other check? Yeah, just the final. Because <laughs> <laughs> I have to. You mean this one? I've got to move this machine for an invisible <laughs> Hugo on this first one. So that'd be you at the end of that one. Okay, yeah. thanks. Good. No, no. Right. And if you could be the other Hugo now, that'd be there. Excellent. This is amazing. <coughs> Thank you, Hugo. Thank you, Hugo. <laughs> That's right. Thank you, Hugo. This war is going to end tonight. The future of both worlds will be in your hands or in his. I got the job. <laughs> Do it again. Don't hit me. Brothers, Don't hit brothers me. Don't put me through all these games. I press the button, I go to the 65th floor, the door's shut, the door's open. <gasps> God, we're here, we're here on the 65th floor, that's amazing. Do no. they ever do any little bit of light aging or anything? It was only on the touch pads, I think. If you're going around with your cleaning, why don't yep. you get a little bit of black even and just rub it into a cup of... 65 looks good. 
Have a happy day. Yeah, he, he won't. Uh, he won't run very fast. Well, we don't mind you calling it out to him as well. Yeah, good. And after you shoot this guy, we don't mind you being a little more casual with the gun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding someone. Okay. Okay. You can stay sitting there. Sixty masks, sixty corresponding weeks, and a lot of people to dress on the day. Feels good. Mm. So steady, steady it around, and then bang over here for the bang in the face. All right, one more. <laughs> so, uh, what is this you're looking at? Um, these are mannequins for the Hell Nightclub for uh, to be strung up throughout the place and to look like sort of real bondage figures. I'm Joe Wallace. Yeah. I'm It's a matting um, agent for um, she's right out here. silicone Where we're using. Um, and it's, uh, various glues and things you, you just mix it in with the chemical, but it's very, very light. And it's being used as part of your process ah. of making a smith. Cabasil smith. I'm 
Lord bless them. Right on. The hour every hour. Let's start daring down here like you did. Let you come up into it. As you come up, throw the kick, lock up, spin. When you come out of it, separate. Two, three. So that's <clears throat> the main criteria is that they fit into the masks. Um, they have to have a thin face um, to fit in the mask. So a lot of the bodies are thinner than Hugo. So we have to build them up both in height and in chest dimension and shoulder dimension. in the beginning and then as she as she lands she has to do this yeah i so think the i think her. the idea is that she's meant to be firing and she's flipping around hello keanu on that yeah, one in the government the, lobby yeah. yeah beautiful and then try to at the time to shoot or not okay okay ready <coughs> okay ready ready set hold on my balance can you hold yeah. my okay set okay ready ready Stop. Bang, 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 Day 118, down. Wait, so you have to open the mouth, the lip up to talk to anyone? Yes, to talk, yes, you have to. Exactly right. More shoulders. Try to bring your shoulders in a little bit more. Hit him in the head early on, so I'm like, I'll do it hard this time. Okay. Hold on a second. This is my son. <laughs> <laughs> I'm left. 
laughing too hard. I'm shaking the camera. for 2001, thanks very much. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Thank you all for the year in the past three months. stay here. I mean, that's not the only reason I suck as well, but it's like every time I go, the momentum of the wire is pulling my shoulder this way. Can you do it? He can do it, yeah. Keep the same timing as... Yeah. Okay, let's go again. From this cast, we pour fiberglass and we form like a saddle that Carrie Ann can sit in exactly skin tight. Almost finished. Maybe I can keep the cast after. You certainly can. These are my girls. These are my girls. Flash! I'll send this one home to my hubby. <laughs> oh my gosh! That's it. Good chance. Yeah, if you can focus. Yeah. Great. Okay. Thank you very much. That is huge! Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> what can you say? Well, it's it's lovely. It's beautiful. It's lovely. So we'll have to probably bring the other one in. So stick him here. Where are the the waterfalls behind, behind me. Behind me. Maybe, what do you think it'll be the, uh, the Crater Matrix ride? I guess, I just put fire. <laughs> oh, down the spine. Okay, uh, stand by on the edge of the uh, pool here to do final check. Okay, cut out. Helps. And then there's so much of it, so trying to breathe is, feels weird. It's almost like so we get... Why, Mr. Anderson? Why? Why do you persist? Like you find the why, that first why, and the first things just run them all is like. The temporary constructs of a feeble human intellect trying desperately to justify it. You can let this shit seethe up and bubble and, you know, choke on your own rage and stuff, but it should all be, you know, like as if... Yeah. Why is he doing this? All right. It's, it's, it's quite a difficult thing because sometimes you feel like, uh, sometimes you, I want to be in there and sometimes so. There's no conflict. He is what he is. He's a program. It's, it's as obvious as this crater that I've just <coughs> smashed you into. As the, the you know, hundreds of me standing over it. 
I mean, you're like basically holding his heart in front of him. Why can't he see it? Why, Mr. Anderson, why? Why do you persist? at the camera, rolls over there. Run! Uh, you would keep, hold, keep holding the door. Yeah, holding, because that guy yeah. still has his arm in there. So we're holding the one with the wounded arm, yeah, and they're watching the other one pass through. You go at him and start firing, like emptying that? the gun. Go that way? You fire once, you all turn, you yell run, run. and you go at him. Okay. And roll sound, rolling. Twin! They're luscious and pouty now. Yeah, yeah, very warm. We'll go faster, don't you think? Yeah, as fast as we can, I think. Sorry. Earlier. Now he stopped for you. I know, but, but I have to I step back. Step back and give him a second, just a second. And swing straight to the top. Yes, yeah, that's good. Right. Yeah, see? He yeah. stopped. Because he stopped. Yeah. Earlier. Better as you can cut down, cut at the same time. At the same time. Okay. Don't let him stop there. Okay. Okay. Keep your head where it was when we set the position. Yep. Now go back a little bit. So round right about there, just hold your position. And the waiter comes in, just shows where the plate's going. Tori, just keep your head back. Okay. That's sort of roughly the position. Yeah. I don't want any of those lights on. Oh, not even one way up there. Oh. Neutron, take out Jillian, take out... Um, Take out uh, Mark, you guys can come down. No, okay. What will you do when you don't have me to train anymore? Because this is it for me. You would just train Keanu. Yeah. Keanu's not as fun to train as I am, is he? <laughs> is he more fun than me? Yeah, different fun. Different fun. Yes. The truth is, he's not as fun. This guy across the face. It's gonna be hard. Excuse you me. You step and you just hit him that way as you turn. Boom. Keep. Yeah. Dialogue coaching? Yeah. Oh, that's great, but somebody stole my pants. Oh, no. Right my first day of acting, they stole my pants. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. I think these bastards stole my pants. No, they wouldn't do that. Oh, yes, they would if they knew where they were. Where are my pants? I don't know. You bastards. <laughs> Get my 
pan. You knew they were up there, didn't you? Yeah, that would be a tree. You're Chicken. hiding up the back in the pipe there. I'm hiding in the pipe. Yeah. Okay, so they weren't with me, so I left to go see the oracle. All by yourself? Yeah. You didn't take your partner with you? I, that's no. Crazy. That don't make no kind of sense, Jane. In the in the in the game. In the game. That's why I'm yeah. confused. Yeah, but there's no, the there's no mention of it's it in the game. game but in the film. Film. What's the hoo ha, fellas? The hoo ha. So here's the Majolner. This is where uh, most of y'all are coming out. Jada and Anthony and Lockie, you guys are hiding in the pipe all the way down there. Okay. And the Logos is sort of over in this direction, maybe over in this direction a bit. I'm trying to understand those ribs. Were they? Okay. We were together, right? Yes. That's what I thought. By the sure. end of it, yeah, we were, because the ship went down. Yes. And that's when I got the gun out. That's, what that's I where I was getting a little confused. Yeah. <laughs> No, this is contemporary dance. <laughs> <laughs> the headband sells it. Everybody needs a headband. Now. Now. Shut up. Okay, and you want me to look back, look, yeah, just and then yeah. up. Okay. Go. And the kick. More. Yeah. Up. Rock and roll. You may. Yup. Yay, sir. Yeah. It might be interesting to see what's actually happening down there. If you're breaky enough, you might see what's happening down there uh, at the sort of zero point. Meeting's over. Retreat to your exits. Agents are coming. How? Kubi! Go. Okay. Uh, Sorry, I just looked this up. I think that was our last one, too. <laughs> yeah. 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 All right, the show is a. The show is getting smaller and smaller. <laughs> We're not opening the door. This is the last envelope with a rock inside it. <laughs> I'm not even going to have a costume because it's in dry cleaning. It's They hawked it, actually. That's we sold it to a Planet Hollywood already. <laughs> I don't think we've ever uh, given a big second year that Whoopi do to an actor yet, but I think we've got one of the finest actors in the world right here. Because we are. Yeah. And we love. Castle McCormick. That was perfect. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> and that was also the very last shooting day for Wu Ping and Eagle on the Matrix 2 and 3. Just want to say thank you very much for
You really got hit right now. That's good. <laughs> Probably should be a statement. It should be a statement. Because you're a wise man. Comprehension is yeah. not a requisite of cooperation. Yes. And so you're always supplied with breath, but don't be afraid to use the breath. They stand there and comprehend the council's choice in this matter. Comprehension is not a requisite of cooperation. This council is hereby adjourned. <laughs> People got no truth about this, brother, yeah. Man, it's the best box of pound for pound in the history of the game. It's a deep thing, man. I used to knock some folk out myself, too. You know what I mean? I'll just knock one or two of them out. <laughs> okay, three, two, one. <laughs> That's a great look, that look. On three, two, one. about it. Here we are, you know, on the set. And uh, people will be studying this thing uh, for uh, for decades to come. And we haven't even seen what the enactment's going to be, the performance is like. Shorts and t-shirts. <laughs> Fuck they know about sleeve garters. <laughs> and they looked at me like, what what they're kind of shiny. It's like, yeah, well, here's what I think. I think before he got woken up, you know what he used to do for a living? He was a barber. <laughs> <laughs> Smith is hitting you, Smith is hitting you. You're hitting back, you're pounding him, you're pounding him, you're pounding him. You can't get out of his clutch, you can't get out of his clutch, you hit him again. Good, and neutral. 
still need flesh and blood. You still need flesh and blood. It's just trying to find a way to enjoy it. But I guess, you know, if you don't enjoy it, it's going to be on the screen, so you got to give it some life. And it's just trying to figure out how to do it. You know? How do you do it? How to do it? How to fly after Trinity and catch her while you're in a chair. Checking out some shots that they shot today they want to see tonight and seeing how much junk's in there that we can take out so that the directors don't have to sit through all the slow motion stuff that they don't want to see. Sorry, this this is supposed to be in the middle. Never mind, never mind. Leave him the way he is. This is just it's a What's song. his belly? Is it B? Oh, because you call it a Line Messiah. to stop watching guy get thrown and stop shot. Have a dear Kristen. K-R-I-S-T-E-N. With your bazookas, you might want to throw them on your shoulder. Okay, and just dip, dip them like that. Excellent. It's a huge set. It fills basically all of stage one and it's got a green screen all the way around it. So boat goes no, first, no, then the kid over. goes, he spills, then those guys go and those guys go as he spills. Right. Mix it up. So some people that side, some people on the other side. On background action. On back, who are you that background action? That's when you go. So you'll go before the kid goes. Mm -hmm. Changing position, coming to the center. Great. These are mainly great. We've all become so hypercritical of everything it does. I don't know if anybody else is going to allow us to take the time and the energy and the money and have the people to be that way. We're all going to be so restricted to, to budgets and time frames and things like that. That right now, not that this doesn't have those restrictions, it's pretty much open to get it right. How do you? Is that it? Yeah, I'm just, I just need to, I just need to find something to, to go for that I think I can get. setting alarms and they can just be like splayed out on the track. When it comes to gore, you can never have enough. 
Okay, we're set and action. Now. 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 Sorry. Got it. Try your last line one more time there, Anthony, and maybe look out and talk a little philosophically, as you say. Mm -hmm. It's nice to have something to look forward to. Indeed it is. Got it. Hey, hey. Got it. it. Two, three. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's it for the game. I'll come to terms with it. I'm going to go see my therapist now. I'm actually pushing the machine as hard as you can go now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The machine has to come with me. Yeah. And I'm already moving into the next move. That's right. The snappier you are, yeah. and then the machine just looks ponderous. Yeah. Oh. Hey, so Mus, along the wind, we're going to throw some blood at the device itself during the shot. I think I've been shot and killed and buried in under all this metal. So that would be a motion picture wrap on Morpheus, Lawrence Fishburne, on Matrix Reloaded. Yeah. Skeletons and genitalia. Oh. Omni genitals. Omni. <laughs> Land on his feet, he laughing, blood spewing out like a fountain in Trevi. Ready and up. Hey, Jane. So again? So again? So we do the drop down or is it just the thrashing? Yeah, just, just the thrashing and then you'll just go into that, uh, you know, our first position last time. Okay, good. Okay, we're set, and three, two, one. And Jack. And Thrasher. And Big Fresh. And another one. And Clench. Tighter. And die. And now. Thanks, everybody.
honored to have worked with all of you and to watch you guys do your thing. It's awesome. We're all really, really lucky to be involved in something like this. This will stay with all of us for the rest of our days. And I'm just going to miss you all. And I hope you think about me, because I'll think about all of you. And It's been an honor. It's been a privilege. It's been a joy to work with you every day. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Are you mobile? 